Welcome back! From a few pallet wood projects in the past, I still have some leftovers. They aren't in the greatest shape, but still have a lot of potential. So, instead of cutting them into a firewood, I'll make a low and comfy deck chair. This chair will be a single seater, so I split this piece into two parts. I'll use the longer one, which is the 67 cm length. An additional row of boards and blocks is needed to achieve the needed height in front. Also, I relocated one wood block to the needed place. Lastly, cut the corner in 45 degrees angle to match the other side. The main bottom part support structure will be made from this piece. Before using it, I would like to reduce the size of it and to remove that one row of board offcuts. After this small modification, cut in half and secure the 50mm wood screws. I still need to add one additional board on the sitting part. I think this one will be just fine. Remove nails. Cut the board to size and screw it into place. The bottom part was finished, let's move on to the back support. All upcoming steps will be requiring boards or blocks only, so I disassembled all left pallet pieces. After good 20 minutes of working with a rubber mallet and crowbar, I came out with this pile of reclaimed pallet wood. Those three boards will be used later for a back support face while those four I'll use now and will make a vertical support structure. First, cut boards to needed length. After that, split a pair of wood blocks and use them as a spacers in between two boards. Hey, press like and subscribe buttons if you like my content. Your support encourages me to keep working on new projects. After some testing, I found that the confessed back support angle is 9 degrees. So I made a template which simplified the alignment process. Marked how much wood must be cut to be able to insert all this part into the open hole. I want to make those pieces less bulky, so I mark the middle on the top and cut diagonally along the length. Since the bandsaw left not so clean cut, I sand it on the belt sander. Because all was measured twice and cut once, the fitment was perfect. And what's left, bread drill and secure with the wood screws. I cut the last three pallet boards to size. They will be used for back support face. Align each board with a few spacers, 
bread drilled and fixed permanently with wood screws. And lastly, sanded it with 120 grit sandpaper to remove all dirt and roughness. At the beginning of this build, my goal was to make as simple as possible and minimalistic design low and comfy deck chair, which still keeps that pallet wood identity. And I think I did it quite well. Sitting position, back support angle, and overall look are exactly spot on. I would like to hear your opinion in the comments too. One more great thing about this build, that the materials could be sourced totally free and all build could be done with minimal hand tools, like a drill and a handsaw. I hope this will inspire and encourage you to make it by yourself. Thanks for watching and till the next time, bye!